Okay, so what we're sitting here is a Class C motor home, but they're really no different than driving a car. What you want to do first is get your seat comfortable. The seat you can move forward or back. The back you can recline. Probably bring your arm rests down. Get comfortable in the seat and then the steering wheel. You want to adjust the tilt steering so that it's comfortable where you'd like it. And then you got side view mirrors. So over there you got the uh, remote control for the mirrors. Now for backing up, those mirrors are what you want to use primarily because they give you the best judge of distance as to where things are. Okay. But motorhomes come with all kinds of neat things now. You've got a backup camera. Okay. So when you do start to back up, you can clearly see to make sure there's no infant come by on a bicycle or you can clearly see what's there. And then you've got side cameras. That's something relatively new. When you put on your left indicator, there's a camera looking down the left side of the motorhome and on the right indicator, a camera looking down the right side. And where does the camera come through? On here? Right, Perfect. right there. So if you're on the highway and you, t you want to change lanes, does that apply as well? Yes. So you could, you takes away the blind spots completely because now you can see down the whole side of the motorhome. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, once you get used to it, then you've got the backup camera, the side cameras, and the mirrors to figure out where, where you're going. So backing these up is easy. When you're looking at towables, it's a little bit different. Um, when you want to back up the motorhome, you just turn the wheel to the left, it'll go to the left. But if you're towing a trailer, when you first want the trailer to turn to the left, you actually turn the wheel to the right. And what immediately, immediately happens is the trailer will start to move in that right direction and then you turn the wheel back again. And you, you get used to it fairly easy. It's it not some uh, practice, definitely. just a bit, of, a bit of practice. Dave, I have two young girls. What are the rules as far as driving in seat belts while the uh, RVs in transit? Great question. You'll find seat belts in most places where you can sit. The rules are that for every passenger on board, there must be a seat belt and everyone should be seat belted in transit in every kind of motorhome. Class C's tend to have more seat belts because they sleep more, but you'll typically get five, six to eight seat belts in a C and, and four to six seat, six seat belts in a Class A. You ready to take it for a drive? All right, let's go.